We often see foxes dead on the side of the road during daytime. They are nocturnal creatures, shy and avoiding man. This is probably why we don't get to actually notice them very much. The best kinds of fox habitat are often where pockets of countryside meet up with recent urban development. In such areas, foxes can reach very high densities. This is a short film about a group of foxes in suburban Essex. They are the Tinkan clan and they consist of a number of adults and juveniles. These cubs are nearly adult size. They may or may not belong to the same litter. They are a large family and it is that time of year when juveniles are becoming hard to distinguish from adults. However, there is a strict social order between cubs and the older foxes. Cubs will normally have to fight for dominance before they reach full adulthood. Bullying is an all too common occurrence. It is important for the young foxes to maintain their rank during this time. Fights break out quite commonly and they further intensify towards the end of the summer season. However, the older foxes are having none of it and the dominant adult male is ready to settle any disputes that might break out. Once he feels that things have calmed down again, the dominant male leaves them be. This young fox appears to have part of his rear leg missing. This could be through to a road traffic accident or some other unfortunate incident during cubhood. He's a subordinate to the rest of the clan. The summer nights are hot and hectic and it is time to take a much needed siesta on the street corner.
Not far from the hustle and bustle of urban life, there is an undisturbed rural wilderness where the foxes can take it easy and even be active during daytime. It is in such places where they may also hunt rabbits. Nearby undisturbed grasslands are a good place to forage and lie out in the sun. There is always plenty of cover to run into if they feel threatened and the high vantage point to scan the surrounding area for anything unusual. It is also a good place to keep an eye out for rabbits. If the fox knows how to approach at the right angle at the right time and place, he may outrun the rabbit. But rabbits keep their wits about them and are always on the lookout for predators. There are often many trials and errors before a hunt is successful. The fox tries somewhere else. The dominant dog fox returns after a hot night's prowling to rest in the comfort of a back garden for the day. He is tired, hot and thirsty and needs a much needed rest. It's not long before he's back on the streets again. As is the rest of the clan. Including Mr. Three Legs. Foxes are becoming an increasingly familiar sight in urban areas and cities. They have adapted very well and it seems that they can survive in any type of habitat or environment. For as long as there are foxes the streets will never be lonely. <laughs> 